I feel so weird being in my living room right now. <laughs> what the fuck is up, my britches? Hello, if you're new here, welcome to Britchmas. Today is day four, I believe. Normally, we're not in this setup, but we're Christmas as fuck right now. So we're going to do a little candle haul. If I'm looking this way, it's because all of my, you know, like my comments and stuff are this way. But I'm going to show you guys what I got at Bath and Body Works because they had the candle day haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like haul videos, I'm a nosy ass bitch. I love haul videos. I love knowing what people buy, especially candles. I am all about that life. So I love these types of videos. Hopefully you guys do too. I'm just sipping on my water while I wait for you guys to come in. So hopefully you guys like that. <laughs> do you guys like my background? Tell me how cute my tree looks right now. I'm living my best fucking life. I love this so much. I'm just waiting to see if, um, if you guys are in here, I see a couple people are watching. Um, comment in the chat so I know that I'm live. And then I'll get into my haul because I saved over $260 today. And my mom was like, Brittany, these will be on set. I'm like, no, mom, you don't understand. This is like a once a year thing that we go nuts. Yay, I got notification finally. Yes, how do we sound? I'm in like, I'm in my living room, so it's a lot more echoey. Let me know if I, if I sound okay. Sweet Lord, the candle day sale was nuts, right? So many people were out today, it was crazy. <laughs> Hi, Chica, what's up, girl? Hey, Bridges, <laughs> your tree is so cute, right? I'm not finished. I'm decorating it. I got a couple more things today. Like I've been buying more shit for my house and I've been doing Christmas shopping. Oh my God. It's ridiculous. Sound is, I'm assuming that means good. Okay. Perfect. Wrapped around the entire store twice and they kept moving. And I was like out in 40 minutes, not too bad. See, that's where we went to a different store. We went to Fayetteville. Normally I go to destiny like uh, in Syracuse, but we went to Fayetteville today. Cause I like that. It's a freestanding store. Cause I do not want to carry 15 candles around with me all day. So we always go to that one for candle day. I uh, love your Christmas look, the tree, the fireplace is perfection. I live in my best fucking life right now. I feel so bougie. <laughs> oh, love your tree. Thanks, girl. I'm so sad I have stuff in my cart and they all sold out. I saw a lot of them sold out um, online, but they were still available in store. So I wanted to tell you guys that if you have, like if you didn't have a chance to shop in store today, like I did, they're still going on or the sale is still going on online because these candles usually retail for like $25. $25. They're on sale for $9.50, which last year Bath and Body Works, they were $8.95. The fuck? I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain though, because I love Bath and Body Works candles. I know not everybody's crazy about Bath and Body Works, but I love these candles so much. Um, I can hear you well. There's an obvious light room, light room echo, but it is an annoying one. Okay, perfect. Yeah, because I got. I mean, I could try moving this closer to me. Does that sound better, having my microphone closer? I know I'm like out of focus, but I didn't want to set up my lights. I just wanted this to be like a chill, like my lights are going to keep going off too because they're like on like a dim. Oh, that's how they're going to stay because it's not picking me up right now. So this is this is going to be the look because a few of my lights just went out because they're on timers. Tree looks so good. Thanks, girl. And use your coupons. I used the 20% off. See what I had, this is how I saved so much money was I had two different coupons and it was, I forget, there was like three different options. I chose that if you spend $40, you got $15 off. So I split up my order because I got 15 candles total. So I split up my order into five, five and five and I got the coupons in the mail. So I ended up getting, there was like, you got a choice of like an $8 product was one of the coupons. You got a free item for up to $13.50. And then that's when I got two body washes because I ran out of mine today. Perfect timing. So I got these for free with that coupon because they were up to $13.50. This retails, this is the sleep body wash. I love this. It's um, lavender and cedarwood. This is $13.50. And then the midnight, this is a, a new men's one. This retails for also $13.50. So I got both of these fall free. We love a good deal. Yes, bitch. Kerosene, I just saw she posted her candle day haul. So if you guys like these, make sure you go check her video out too. Yeah, sounds better. Okay, perfect. So I'll leave it right. It's like right in my cooch, but it'll stay there. <laughs> you are so smart. I didn't plan it out and I should have, right? That's why I wanted to share this. So if you haven't shopped the sale yet and you got those coupons, split it up into transactions. So I did five, five, and five for my candles. And then I got three free items. My mom, she's like, 
I'm going to have you get me a body wash. So I got the other, so I got three body washes technically, but one of them isn't mine. So we got those for free. Now I did my, um, my candles different. So each, um, each transaction ended up coming up to 3510. Normally it would have been, hold on, hold on. Let me do some quick math here, but I did like the overall total. So if I were to buy five candles at full price, it would be $122.50 for five candles plus $13.50 for a body wash. So normally I would have spent $136, which I never buy these candles at full price ever. I at least get them for like buy one, get one half or like buy one, get one free, buy two, get two free. I always buy them on a deal, but this is the time that I always stock up on them is because this is the cheapest that we're going to find them. And then the overall total that it would have been would have been... $367.50 and what I actually paid for everything was $105.30. And I'll have enough candles for the entire year. Cause I did my um I did my haul a little bit different this year because normally I just buy a shit ton of winter candles. I didn't do that this year. I actually planned in advance and I'm like, okay, I know I like these for like spring, summer, you know? So that's how I did this year. So the first one, I had them all separated and how I wanted to talk about them. And then the lady like switched over my little containers because if you went in store, that's probably so annoying. If you went in store, you could actually like shop with these and then she would like transfer them over when she scanned them. So I'm like, she's killing my vibe right now. Cause I had them all like in order cause I got duplicates of some and so on and so forth. So I'll just start. I'm going to try not to knock over my microphone. Just don't fart. <laughs> I know. Right. That'd be, <laughs> So embarrassing. <laughs> I'm loving this setup. Can't wait to watch tomorrow before I sleep today. Need to finish 354 blog post. Uh, reply for my gender. So he says, oh my God, I freaking love you. You're so funny. Uh, don't feel bad, Kara. You weren't alone. Oh, what did Kara say? Oh, I wasn't as smart. I didn't have any coupons. Just a dream and a wish for some cheap ass candles. <laughs> Either way, even if you got some candles today, that's still a win because they never are this cheap. So the first one, I got two of these. I got fresh balsam. Now I was just watching Kara or I was listening to Kara's video on the way back, like on the drive home. And she's like, I don't, I don't, I don't really like candles. I'm like, I'm such a candle bitch. I love candles. I always have them burning. I have them burning in like different areas of my house almost at all times. As long as I'm home, I love candles so much. So the first one that I got is fresh balsam. This one is for those of you that have a faux Christmas tree, but you want it to smell like a real Christmas tree because this stuff smells exactly like a fresh pine tree. It smells so fucking good. I wanted to get um, evergreen. That's another one that smells very similar to this. I think this one has a little bit more, I want to say of an artificial smell to it, but I don't know. I think I like evergreen just a hair bit more, but they're so close and they didn't have any ever, they didn't have any evergreens in store. So I ended up getting two of these because I know I'm going to burn through these because I fucking love candles. Like I said, and especially this time of year. Oh yeah. I'm definitely going to burn through these. Oh man. I'm like out of breath. Hold on. Let me take a sip and read through some comments here. Any idea if there's any deals on tomorrow? I heard they were putting out new scents. I wouldn't be surprised if they had new scents out, but I don't think that they're going to have any deals or anything. Um, I'm pretty sure they do this deal because they're trying to get rid of all of their like winter scents. At least I think I'm like looking in the viewfinder. I look so grimy, but that's okay. Candles make the house smell so inviting. Oh, it's my favorite when houses smell lush, right? That's where I'm like, I have dogs too. And that's why I like these candles so much is because it will like mask the smell because if you walk in my house and there's not candles burning, it just smells like a big dog, you know? Fresh balsam is the shit. So good, right? I love that one. Okay, next one. I put this one to the front because I don't know why I took this one out first. This one, I also got two of this. This is eucalyptus mint. This is, I get compliments on this every time we have um, guests over because I always put this in the bathroom. Somebody could blow that bathroom up. And this is smells so, so good. It's like a it's almost like a spearminty kind of scent, but it just, I don't know. It's just so fresh. It's just a really nice fragrance. And then, like I said, if you blow up a bathroom, I feel like it might stink at first, but then it'll kind of mask it eventually. 
I just love the scent of this. I always get compliments, like I said, on it. So I got two of these because this is like my designated like bathroom scent. So I have another one somewhere in here. Oh, there go my lights again. <laughs> I don't know how they just turned on. I think for my dog. Love eucalyptus mint. Yes. People were commenting in line. Yes. I'm that bitch that makes friends with the line saying Yankee candles have no throw anymore. You can't smell them. See, I thought the same thing. Like I bought Yankee candles off of like fundraisers for kids and stuff. And I would light them and I'm like, I can't smell those at all. So I don't buy Yankee candles. I always buy Bath and Body Works. I want to try the ones that um, Jen loves reviews. She always talks about this one company. I want to try those ones, but then candle that came up first. So I'm like, Okay. Or I shouldn't say it came up first, but it's just, I knew that this was coming and I like plan in advance for this sale. Oh man. Eucalyptus, eucalyptus mint and twisted peppermint are my go-to bathroom scents. Yes. Damn. I should have bought that one. I smell like a full on waste disposal plant since I had my surgery. <laughs> I mean, it's not too late. You could always go on. <laughs> oh my God. You are too funny. Oh, this is the other eucalyptus mint. I like how they did like the different, um, like the same scents, but with different like coverings on them, you know? So I got this one to put in there for right now. Cause this is like the vibe of like, I'm doing like blue for Christmas this year. The kids were not thrilled about it. They're like, where's all the red? I'm like, I wanted to do something different. So I got a lot of blue going on. So that's why I got this one here. So this is another eucalyptus mint. Put that one there. Hopefully I don't break nothing. Let's see. The next one I got is Snow Mountain Lodge. I got this one last year. It has like a, I don't know. It just has that. If you walked into a lodge, this is what it would smell like. That's the perfect name for it. It's got like a woodsy, just cozy, warm. It almost has like the smell of fireside to it, but not I don't know. It's like the weirdest thing. Like as soon as I smelled it, I'm like, that smells like if I were to walk into like a ski lodge or something like that. This is one of my favorites. This sold out so fast last year. If you guys, if I talk about any and you guys know if any have sold out online, please leave it in the, or in the live chat or in the comments after. Um, just got a notification that they sold out online. Oh, damn. So they sold out of everything online. Holy shit. Oh, that's a bummer. I'm sorry, you guys. <laughs> Very pretty packaging. Yeah, I really like this one too. I like how they do all the different ones. All candles. Holy shit. People went in this year. Let's see. Next one I got was, oh, I got this one specifically for spring. Actually, these are two of the same ones. So I got two of the white gardenia. These smell so, so fucking good. They smell just like fresh cut, fresh cut flowers. I love these scents for the springtime, but I will not really burn them any other time. Like I got two of these ones and then I got two of another one just specifically for spring, just because they just, it smells like I have a fresh bouquet of cut flowers in my whole entire household. So I love those ones. So that was fresh gardenia, right? Fresh gardenia, white gardenia. Love the packaging on this too. They had other ones that weren't nearly as cute. So I got these ones. Love those. I don't, I just saw somebody said flannel is my favorite. I don't think I got flannel. I think that was one I picked up and I was like, eh, no, I don't really need that one. So I have another six little, six little packaging down here. So the next one I got, this was another spring one. This is peach Bellini. I got this one because Shannon loves this smell. And it does. It smells so good. It smells just like if you don't like peach, you will not like this at all. It's just a really nice peach, almost like a more peachy version of champagne toast, I would say. That's kind of what it reminds me of. I didn't like the gardenia. It's a headache smell for me. See, I'm that way with mahogany teakwood. I heard you talking about that. And I'm like, that one gives me a headache so bad. I love the smell of that one, but I always get a headache. I like the ones that are like mixtures with the mahogany teakwood. Like, um, what was it? Mahogany or what was it? Coconut teakwood or no, it was mahogany, coconut, uh, mahogany apple. Like the ones that are kind of mixed with that. I love because I think it balances it out for me because that always give, gives me a headache. They sold out completely online by 1.30 p.m. Ontario, Canada time. So are they sold out in the U.S. or just in Canada or both? Um, I didn't get Cactus Blossom, and I wish I freaking would have. I smelled so nice. That one did smell nice. I smelled that like four times today. I smelled so many candles today. It was ridiculous. I was in and out pretty quick, though. I was impressed with myself. Uh, next one, I got, I think, two of these, too. 
marshmallow fireside. Bitch, this is my favorite one of all of time. Oh my God, I could just sit here and just smell it. It's the perfect definition of what it smells like, marshmallow and a fire. It smells so good. Fireside, marshmallow fireside. I wish they still had smoked coconut. Like if you ever see smoked coconut, smell it. Oh, that's like my favorite one. That That is my number one. This would probably be number two or three in comparison with, or comparison, that's not the right word. Comparative to Fireside. I guess that's the easiest way for me to say it. They have single wicks um, in the U.S. for sure. Just check completely sold out online. Oh, man. <laughs> Suck. That's horrible. Uh, they only have a U.S. site to order, but they shipped. Oh, okay. I regret not buying hot buttered rum and Fireside. Oh, my God. Fireside's so good. Hot buttered rum. That's not my favorite one. I think that's one that I would like for, like, smelling it because I was going to buy, like, mint chocolate chip or it was something like that. And I was like, I think I like it just to smell it but I don't think I would like it to smell in my entire house for like the entire day, you know? Uh, the next, oh, this is another Marshmallow Fireside. Tell me how cute this packaging is though. So aesthetically pleasing, love though. I, I just love Marshmallow Fireside so much. Next one, Spiced Apple Toddy. I was looking for um, cinnamon sticks and they were all sold out in store. Oh my God, funny story. <laughs> this is why I'm so glad I don't work retail anymore. Like there was this one older guy, he comes in and he's like, I keep, I'm like overhearing this as I'm just scouring through all the candles. He's asking so many questions about one single candle. And she's just like, sir, I'm sorry. It's candle day. It's like, that's why everybody's here right now. Like we've been open since 6 AM. And she's like, if we, if you don't see it, like we don't have it. He's like, well, you open at six o'clock, right? And she's like, yeah. And he goes, well, was the candle here at six o'clock this morning? She's like, yeah. <laughs> I was just like thinking in my mind, I'm like, what the fucking point? <laughs> what was the point of asking that question? But I was just laughing. I'm like, I'm so glad I don't work retail anymore. <laughs> Anyways, back to Spice Apple Toddy. I was looking for cinnamon sticks or something along those lines because I love just the smell of like the cinnamon pine cones. This doesn't have that exact smell, but it's got that nice cinnamon, almost like apple pie-ish smell. Not so much, but it smells good. It smells like cinnamon pretty much, so I really like that one. Uh, let's see. I can't imagine working retail. I wouldn't deal well with it. <laughs> I'm just listening. I'm like, he like he's well aware of how busy it is right now, and she was like stressed to the max, and he's just asking one question after another, and it's like... It could have easily been answered like, hey, do you have this candle? No, I'm sorry. Okay, thank you. <laughs> like, and it was just like one dumb question after another. I was just like, oh my God. Oh, it was so funny. Okay, next one is holiday. I was debating between this one and another like, was it apple spice? I think it was. This is another like cinnamon smell. This has a little bit more. I don't know. Hang on. Let me compare these two because they kind of smell similar. I think the holiday smells a little bit more like spicy though. Yeah, this smells like it'd be more of like a baked good, you know, whereas this one smells like, I think more of like what actual cinnamon sticks would smell like. I wonder if this is supposed to be, let's see, red cinnamon stick, Christmas clove, what Christmas clove buds. Ground nutmeg and essential oils. Ozzy, get upstairs, please. He's trying to go downstairs and take a poop because that's what he always does. And I just let him outside. Oh, my God. Do you guys want me to read, like, the the notes underneath or don't you care? Are you guys liking my uh, half-ass explanations? I probably should have asked you that before, but I didn't realize the notes were right on the bottom of the freaking candle. Okay, next one is going to be leaves. This is another, like, fall, winter one that I really like. This one smells really similar to, no, it smells like almost like apple cinnamon, but not as cinnamony smelling as the other two. This one has more of a just apple, apple smell. So this is leaves. I liked, they had this one and they had another God awful looking one. So I picked this one instead. I hate, 
I hate when they're like, you love the smell of them and then you don't like what the packaging looks like, you know? <laughs> Leaves is my favorite for fall. I love that one too. The notes are on the bottom. Fuck me. I struggled so hard trying to explain. I didn't realize it until I like flipped it over to look and see if holiday was actually supposed to be like cinnamon stick. Yeah. So it says, let's see. Snow Mountain Lodge is going to be smoked embers, silver pine, sandalwood with essential oils. Yes. Your tree is beautiful. I just came from Kara's video and saw your comment that I got noticed that you posted. Yes, girl. <laughs> All right. So that's it for that bag. So I got one more bag. I'm going to bring it over here. I'm sorry if oh, I only got two left in here. <laughs> Shereen, lol. Oh, so these are going to be fresh cut lilacs. These are other ones that I got for springtime. Super cute. This smells just like if you were to cut lilacs and put them in a vase, put them on your table, and they smell up your entire house. That's exactly what this smells like. I had this one in like a single wick last year, and I loved it. So I bought two of these right? Yes. So I bought two of these for this year. And that's all the candles that I got. What candles did you guys get? Let's have a little chitty chat. What kind of candles did you guys get? <laughs> oh, excuse me. Love the tree. Thanks, girl. Do you guys like, excuse me, do you guys like, like the vibe right now? I probably should have brought up my ring light and it would have looked better. I couldn't find the lilac one in the store. There were so many in our store. So damn many. I don't know. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I wanted to tell you guys, but I think I smashed it. Out of everybody that's been shopping though, how many of you guys have been buying more stuff for yourself than you are for other people? Because that's the boat that I'm in right now. <laughs> I'm buying so much stuff like for Chris, like Christmas decorations for my house. It's ridiculous. I keep finding so much good stuff. The vibe is so comfy, right? I bought too many to name them all. What's like the favorite one? If you were to pick, let's see, top three. Give us your top three that you got. I'm loving the vibe. Yes, I love it. Oh my God, I spent crazy amounts on myself. <laughs> Other people. <who. laughs> okay, good. So I'm not alone. I'm not by myself now. Let's see. It happens all the time, right? I got Yankee Candles, Gingerbread, and Feliz Navidad. Oh, they have such cute names. Not that I think about it. Did they even have any gingerbread candles at Bath and Body Works? I don't think I saw any. Home Goods is awesome for Christmas decor. Dangerous. Me and my mother have been to so many fucking Home Goods. It's ridiculous. I was hoping Gooey Marshmallow would come back for this year. Oh, I love that one last year too. I actually just finished burning that one <laughs> from last year. I love that one. Same here. Bought so much for myself and I have to start for family and friends. <laughs> I was getting so annoyed today though, because I was trying to get all of my shopping done and then all of the sizes that I needed sold out. So I'm like, fuck. And then they're like, oh, well, we can, we can order it for you. It's free shipping. I'm like, well, I can do that my damn self, but that's why I came in store. <laughs> uh, same here. Oh, I read that one already. And Aspen came in and said, hi, Bridges. <laughs> Tell her what's up, girl. Flannel, strawberry pound cake. Oh, that was one I didn't see, but I wanted to smell it. Because I heard that one sold out fast last year. And Cafe, I'll, I'll, I don't know how to say that. I didn't smell that one either. Does that one smell like coffee, though? I almost got another Paris Cafe, but I didn't like that one when I burned it. I wish I had more home goods near me. So we always drive to Syracuse or Rochester. Rochester is where it's at for home goods for us. Um, but I wish like our Auburn store, cause the Auburn store is just like a Marshall's. So we always have to go to Rochester or Syracuse. Um, oh my God. Aspen is so funny. She's so damn cute. All right. Well, I think that's it for today's video. Um, I just wanted to share with you guys what candles I got. Cause I'm a nosy bitch. I love watching haul videos. Um, I'm trying to think of what my next video will be. I tried like filming us putting up our tree yesterday and I was like, oh, the kids are coming over. Like, and they just kind of did a little bit of it. And then I just took over and started doing the rest of it because they just did not want to be bothered. Um, so I filmed some of that. I got more stuff today. I don't know. Do you guys want to see like a my Christmas decor type video? I don't know. <laughs> I saw some people request something like that. So I'm like, do people actually care? 
Um, we don't have a home goods here. Uh, oh, but you guys have like, um, I think Amy Macedo always talks about like winners, right? Is that the one she always talks about? Any makeup tutorial of some sort, please. Like what kind of, do we want any Christmas looks? Like I, I like can't stand when people do Christmas tutorials because when I'm like, when it's Christmas in the Clark household or like my family's household, I don't wear makeup. I don't wear Christmas makeup on Christmas. I'm just like, let me live my best life in either my pajamas or my sweats. And I just want to be comfy all day. Like, I don't want to do my makeup. Like, why? I don't, that's where I'm like, <laughs> do you guys want, I, I mean, I could do something. I like me personally, I just don't wear makeup on the holidays except for like new year's, but I haven't gone out for new year's in like seven years. I think because I feel like I'm always working on new year's. Mm. My store had three strawberry pound cakes. My sister somehow found them all. And yes, cafe smells like coffee and I'm in love with it. Yes. Oh my God. I'm so jealous about that strawberry pound cake. Cause I wanted that last year. Um, vanilla snowflake, spiced apple toddy. I can't remember all of them. No, but I got like six, I think. Yes. Um, we should start a tree. We should start a tree thread on Twitter. Oh, I started a TikTok. Do you guys watch TikTok? Oh my God. I'm like obsessed with TikTok right now. I love watching food recipes. I think I talked about this already on my channel. Food recipes and the Starbucks baristas. Oh my God. I'm like infatuated when I get starting to watch those. I'm just like, I love it. It's so aesthetically pleasing to me. Oh my God. So I, I posted a couple of TikToks. I'm going to post like my, uh, my room transformation on there. I think, wait, maybe we do. We have some we have home something and it's basically more home theme winners Marshall's. Yeah. I forget which one that she home sense. That's the one she always talks about home sense. I love your Disney Jersey. I wore my holiday one too. Yes. Oh, I walked into the Disney store today and she's like, Oh, I love your shirt. <laughs> and I didn't even think about it. Love Xmas decor. Would love to see what you got for Xmas decor. So maybe I'll do that. I'm comfy on Christmas too. Hell, it's all about the Christmas jammies. Exactly. Christmas jammies or sweats. Give me all the comfies. Um, I don't wear Christmas makeup either. I wore Christmas jam. <laughs> I know. We're all about the Christmas jammies. Home sense. Yes. <laughs> all right. So that's going to be it for tonight's video. I'll be back. What's today? I don't even know what today is. Today's Saturday. So I'll be back on Monday. We'll be doing a new makeup releases on Monday. So if you guys have any products, anything that we want to talk about on Monday for a yes or yawn, you guys will have to leave it in the comments when we come back or when I post this video, leave it in the comments on what video that you got or what video. Oh my God. Leave in the comments what makeup products or beauty products that you guys want to talk about in next week or I can't fucking talk today or keep a train of thought on Monday's video. Leave a comment on any products that you guys want to talk about. <laughs> All right. That's it for tonight's video. I hope you guys have enjoyed your shopping and got all the Christmas candles that you were looking for. <laughs> Bye.